Hey guys, it's Shar, and welcome back to The Sims 4 Get Together. So, I am basically kind of recording this back to back because why not? The flow was so good, so might as well, right? So, I'm going to have everybody get something to eat here, and I'm just going to kind of put the food away. Everybody is super tired um and super hungry and had an amazing freaking night they partied at what in the world is going on with this milk <laughs> um like seriously like <laughs> but um they had an amazing night we had a a huge freaking party slash gathering at the ancient ruins and it was freaking bad freaking a like seriously everybody and their grandmom came out like our papa had a good time our girl chloe had a good time there was some woohoo action there was some bush action um and even a fire dance it was oh my god like they just had such a a freaking great time so papa still wants to schedule in a date with her so maybe we'll be able to do that in this part he also wants to hit bump somebody as well if um our girl wants to sleep over she definitely can we have we kind of have the space for it but not really but you know she can come and crawl into our bed it's it's super good like <laughs> um but i'm going to have javi come over here and get some sleep as well and then for paloma if you could just finish your food here and then i'm going to go ahead and send her on to bed oh my god i should have taken pictures i should have taken pictures i'm so oh my goodness but we're totally going to update our social network even check to see how many followers we have and then i'm going to send her on to bed as well and um papa is just over here kind of cleaning up a little bit washing the dishes and chloe is just not liking us i guess i don't really know what that was about we weren't even talking to her but she's going to go ahead and watch the tv and paloma is going to clean up as well i'm just going to fast forward this a little bit and it looks like we have a phone call. Uh, let's see here. Hey, I heard you became friends with Morgan Longo. She's pretty cool. Who's Morgan? Like, who is that? Who's Morgan? Oh, I mean, this girl who is trying to get our attention all night, please. <laughs> like, please. Like, seriously. She can kick rocks somewhere. Not interested. Oh, there's Fallon again. Like, seriously, look at her. She is just always walking to who knows where. Like, who knows where? I don't ever see her. I seriously don't. Um, but you know what? Speaking of her, let me show you guys where she lives at. So both her and... Um, Jordan live over here. So Paloma has 18 followers. Um, but Jordan and, and Fallon live over here in this very modern type of house. And he has himself a DJ booth. I did download this house off the gallery. It's super beautiful. Definitely edited it a little bit and gave them a nice little, um, little swimming pool feature here that came with the game a little diving dock i'll say but the pool was already here it's super beautiful it's so narrow but this house is gorgeous look at this look at this <laughs> but that's where they live at i love it but um let's see here so it looks like chloe decided to leave and there's a floating coffee cup over here like absolutely great and we do have a phone call um oh Hey, I heard you became friends with Candy. Alrighty, and um, let's see here. So, hey, welcome to Spin Masters Hobby. Try starting a gathering from the club menu. Um, alrighty, so we definitely did do a gathering. So, I mean, you was there. But anyways, I'm going to go ahead and speed on through the sim sleeping, and I will wake up with you guys in the morning. See, there I go again, waking up with you guys. But hey, it is what it is. <laughs> so, um... We got a phone call from uh, Chloe. Hey, Gino, it's me, Chloe. Do you want to go out on a date at the Blue Velvet? Now, mind you guys, it is about 1.42 p.m. The Sims literally, literally just got in the house like 
probably about eight hours ago <laughs> or or less and they're just now getting to sleep but you know what he was definitely wanting to go out on a date with her so she's the one calling us she's obviously into us right now so we're going to take her up on this offer because we are interested so once we get to the lot i will meet you guys when we get there hey guys so there was actually a slight change of plan so we did meet up with chloe at the blue velvet lounge and i went ahead and placed a lot down and it just was not working it was a complete disaster from the moment that lot was placed every single sim that showed up to that lot just came and went they didn't even want to step foot inside it was completely whack they just did not want to even take a look at it they were just like no Shar, this is a mess and they just said no like nothing was working anyway and gino really wanted to take her out on a date so we basically just went ahead and took her back to windenburg to take her to a place that we enjoy because she already knew how to pull at his heartstrings by already inviting him to a bar in the middle of the afternoon she already knew we loved our whiskey on ice okay like she definitely knew a way to his heart and i just i love them like <laughs> i absolutely love them so right now He's just basically trying to chat with her. And of course, on their way back, it had to snow just a little bit. <laughs> and um, I don't know, it just looks so pretty. So right now, we are in um, this cute little area at the Shuriking Llama. This is where his group loves to hang out at. And he really wanted to, to basically take her to somewhere that he really enjoys. So... Um, let's go ahead and flirt with her a little bit and heartfelt compliment her. I also went ahead and changed up her outfit, giving her this really cute outfit from the Get Together expansion pack. And I also gave her um, a little bit of makeup and a custom content skin. But anyways, um, I did go ahead and uh, update this place a little bit. I kind of figured you guys have already seen what the Shrieking Llama look like. And I went ahead and edited it just a little bit. Um, and by a little bit, I do mean a lot because why not? Um, but before I go ahead and show you guys around, let's go ahead and get a drink for our girl here. So let's go ahead and order drinks for a group. And let's see what we got here. We have the Barley Bell Root Bear Float. Ooh, a Cupid Juice. 56 million like yes like yes let's go for it um so we're going to go ahead and order ourselves a drink here and eliza pancakes is the freaking bartender like seriously she could not get a job nowhere else because nobody wants her even her own husband was seen dancing with another girl like <laughs> like nobody wants you like nobody <laughs> <laughs> they hate each other like seriously i do not know how that happened um but um i don't understand look she can't even count honey i asked for two drinks not one like oh my god this girl this girl needs like a freaking math lesson like let's go ahead and sit over here with our date and um let's see if we can order a drink for her because eliza can't count like seriously there's two people, two people in a group. I asked for a group drink. Look, like <laughs> like, I did unbelievable. Oh my god. Okay. Um. So it looks like Katrina is here. And oh my god, scandalous, scandalous. Like Bumblebee skirt with some freaking converses. <laughs> <laughs> um oh my god paloma would get a field day out of this girl but anyway so this is the lot here i went ahead and added in this so freaking cutesy looking dance floor oh my god it's so adorable i love it and i changed the wallpaper to green because it was super like dookie brown in here could not <laughs> so i went ahead and put the um the little uh game the new game that came with the expansion pack i put this over here on the side and um i had the food staple over here kind of just added some new wallpaper to the bathrooms added in this whole mirror section over here and some banging tunes over here um i added in this whole this like new bar set which i really do like and it came with the game as well 
And I also added in a dartboard. I have not seen this yet and I am super excited to definitely go ahead and test it out. So I'm glad she got a drink. It isn't what we ordered, you know, for her to be completely honest. So let's go over here and uh, let's see here. Let's go ahead and try again to order, you know, ourselves both some Cupid juice. I know he's almost close to having to go to the bathroom. He did increase his charisma to level five. Um, like seriously, I don't know if she's just trying to be smart and not give our date a drink or, or what. Instead, she just gave her like, it looks like, what is this? I have no idea, but it, it looks, it looks nasty. It looks nasty. <laughs> but anyways, I'm, I'm glad that she's being a trooper about it. But I want to take you guys downstairs um, to show you what I did to the, uh, the group hangout. So down here, I placed in a fish tank. I'll go ahead and put the walls up so you can see. Isn't this such a cute little design? <laughs> I love it. Isn't it cute? Um, so I went ahead and added in some new seating and um, a new bar. Over here, another dartboard, a gaming system, which I think is so amazing. And look at this. Oh, it matches so perfectly. I love it. I also added in a closet and a foosball table down here as well. I think it's super cute. And I really, I really love this area for his group because, I mean, they are the good timers, not the old timers, okay? Like, let's be honest here. So, ooh, Papa is feeling super flirty. Okay, pummeled by Cupid, that drink has given Gino some warm and fuzzy feelings. Oh yes, yes, and he wants to kiss somebody, oh my god. So she finally got her drink, which I'm so happy about. We're definitely going to come over here and um, flirt it up with her a little bit, even go ahead and uh, let's give her a rose if we have that. Let's go ahead and blow her a kiss and... Um, We'll go ahead and embrace her and just kind of build up that, you know, that relationship that they had. They have such a strong one. And, you know, I think that's really, really important. And um, let's see here. I want to give her a rose. Let's go ahead and offer her a rose. So it is about 644 and the kids are just now realizing that their grandfather has not come home yet. So they're just going to kind of come here and just see what is going on like where are you you know you're not home you're not home you've been partying like with us like your freaking 16 granddad <laughs> like um but let's go over here and change Javi's outfit and we'll go ahead and change Paloma's outfit as well and just have them just kind of you know surprise their grandfather and um Let's see here. I'm going to have Javi come over here and talk about the latest party because he, he doesn't care. You know, he's just so happy for his grandfather to be getting out of the house and just having himself a good time. Paloma, on the other hand, she wants to order herself a drink, but I'm going to have her come over here and... Um, Let's go ahead and uh, talk about him a little bit. Let's ask about his day. Like, yes, how was your day? Because you were not home. And, um... I want to see if we can take a picture of that girl because <laughs> I seriously, I seriously have to. Oh, she got a dance floor too. All right. So let's go ahead and take a photo of, um, I want to take a photo of that girl who looks a hot mess because we're definitely going to be talking about this chick for sure. So I think it's Precious. Oh my God. Is her name Precious? No. Precious red. Okay, she's wearing red. She oh, her hair is red. Like she <laughs> she just looks a mess. Like there's Oh, girl. I mean, she's so she's cute though, but oh, she's just oh my god. But we're definitely going to come over here and um take a picture of her before she heads on out. She already knows. So Paloma's going to come outside really fast and take a picture of this girl. And, um, okay, so Papa's day ended. Nice day. There are some flowers in your Sims household inventory. Um, hopefully, um, our girl stays, though. So we're still going to, um, hang out with her. He definitely wants to give her a kiss. So why don't we ask her to hang out and, um, just try to catch her really fast. All right, so I'm going to have Papa go over there 
And this girl, <laughs> she thinks she looks so cute. Um, okay, let's go ahead and do like a narrow, like a narrow photo here. Oh my god, like she she just definitely thinks she looks cute. Wait until we tell Jay like this freaking like train wreck that we just ran into. Like, look at this. Oh my god, you guys have to tell me like what I should do like with these um these photos we take of people because I don't know if I want to do like a wall somewhere or um I don't know I don't know definitely if you guys have any ideas um let's definitely oh this is so pretty okay S seriously really quick though like <laughs> this we definitely need to take a picture of this because this girl is not that serious that we need to um waste all of our shots on her but um let's see here so um clank clank heroic gentle person gather about don your armor for night night and get a sweet discount oh so it's night night or something like that but you know what papa definitely wanted to um kiss this girl and he wants to compliment her appearance why don't we um group up with her really fast and I want them to have like a romantic kiss. Oh, okay, so I guess they are in a group together, which is perfect. Um, I want them to like go somewhere super romantic and um, I don't know, like get this kiss of his because I, I definitely think it would be great of them to to have their first kiss tonight. So why don't we just go here? Oh yes, let's do it. Let's go here together. Um, and I told you guys he's a little bit of an alcoholic. All he wants to do is just get drinks and all that jazz. So we have her all by ourselves. So let's go ahead and um, get our first kiss from her, which I think would be super cute. I think the tree went missing though. Oh, it's so pretty. Let me see. Oh no, it's right there. Oh my God. <laughs> it's so cute. I love it. Um, let's go ahead and, um, I mean, it's not the most, you know, romantic thing, but I mean, come on. Like, they're just, they're older, you know, like, they look at life differently than, you know, people in their 20s do. <laughs> oh, he wants to woohoo. Ooh, like, he is definitely, you know, he is definitely indecisive, like, definitely. <laughs> but we're going to... Um, I think have her go back over here um, together and he's pretty hungry so we're going to go ahead and order order ourselves some food let's go ahead and um, maybe order ourselves some uh, let's see here let's order ourselves a bread roll and um, Javi is over here talking to um, this girl over here and here are the knights um, let's see who these are so we have Cecil Milligan we also have uh, Philip Harper and we have Morgan Longo. So since we're here, why don't we go ahead and start a group gathering and as for Paloma, I definitely want her to maybe invite one of the guys out to hang out with her. So let's see here. So we have Fallon and I'm thinking maybe she can go ahead and invite out um, Marcus and um, where is Chloe? Where is Chloe? Oh my God, where did she go? I don't know where she went, but he's feeling super flirty and I don't know if she left or not. Let's see, so she did leave. Let's go ahead and try to invite her back out. And he is, um, oh, you know what? No, cause he is definitely feeling super smelly right now. Oh my, how did he get so smelly? I don't understand. Oh my god. Um, so she said she was coming over, so we definitely need to maybe freshen up a bit. So why don't we go over here and kind of be a little, <laughs> let's be a little cheap here and kind of just, you know, take a sponge bath a little bit to get our our hygiene up and is uh okay great so marcus is here so i mean in the last part um you know marcus wasn't really kind of giving paloma any play i really feel bad for her because she's really trying to separate herself from her brother and she's really trying to find her own way and right now it just kind of seems like people are getting in the way but let's go ahead and brighten his day describe a new idea 
Um, but let's see. So he's going to go downstairs and dance. How's about no? Why don't you go over here and um let's go ahead and play some chip tune because apparently the DJ left. Um, but you know, Paloma really wants to get to know Marcus and she really likes him a little bit. And um, but he's not really kind of showing any interest in her, you know. Like look at this. Like it seems like he's leaving again. And it kind of tells her a lot, you know, like she's just she this is this is how it has always been, you know, like she's always tried to get to know her brother's friends and she's made a lot of friends through her brother. But trying to make friends on her own is really failing her. But I don't know. I think it's about time that we just go ahead and go on home. But you know what? Before we do that, let's go over here and um, talk to Bjorn about this fool and discuss feelings about the good timers. Let's go ahead and um, let's go ahead and do the club handshake and then we can also um, be mean and just kind of talk about other sims and then just trash the keys because you know he's been such a jerk to us he's already booing Bjorn he doesn't like us he doesn't really want to be a part of this group and we have to find any way that we can to to try to get him out of here if we can um, I really like leading the good timers. I'm pretty sure that the members would say that I'm doing a great job. And that sounds terrible. I'll talk to Jaquees myself. So I hope he does. Um, are you going to talk to him? Okay. Okay. I need I don't, this. I don't know what's going on. Like my game is just acting super silly right now. We already just talked to Bjorn about Jaquees. And he obviously didn't do anything. He just kind of... He kind of just basically just let it roll off his shoulders and it kind of bothers him a little bit. I mean, he's just kind of standing there and he's trying to be okay about it. But that's the thing with him. Like he just, he feels like he has to just kind of go with the flow a lot of the times and he doesn't really want to cause a lot of drama. He's just really about talking to other people about his problems and then hopefully it will be resolved. And I think it's about time that we head on home. I'm not exactly sure. Um, there's nobody really dancing. This lot is just not really that great right now. Paloma is taking a nap um, over here. Oh my God, so this is what the nap interaction looks like paloma does not look comfortable at all um everybody is tired and smelly and she is just sleeping in a bush i'm gonna have her i'm gonna have her wake up and just send her on home um <laughs> oh she's so cute i love it but i'm going to send her on home now uh let's see so their grandfather is on his way home too and then Javi is not too far behind. But anyways, um I don't know. Like so somebody told me that the Eva that um Javi had met is a stay-at-home mom, which is so crazy. So I definitely have to check that out. As for Paloma, she is constantly always getting dissed. Like she doesn't really have the best luck when it comes to guys, apparently. Like trying to get to know people on her own is definitely tough. And it's something that she didn't expect. But anyways, once we get to the lot, I will meet you guys. I'm just going to have Paloma come over here and take herself a shower. Javi is already upstairs taking himself a bath. And Papa is um, playing some Sims forever. But I definitely want him to go ahead and take himself a shower too. And then he can get ready and go to bed as well. Let's see um, if what we have here in her inventory about this of this girl though. Let's go ahead and um, let's see here. Oh, our, oh my God, you guys, how pretty is this picture though? Like, oh my goodness, which one's the best one? This is, oh my God, this is quality is outstanding. The ambience is focused. Oh my goodness, 15 and 19. Okay, so we're going to sell this one. This is so pretty. Oh my God, add frame. That is so pretty. Oh my God. Um, And this girl is not, uh, let's see here. So we have, oh, this one's a good one. That one is a good one, too. So let's go ahead and then delete these pictures as well. We'll also sell this um, dance floor because we already have one. 
and um i don't know but again you guys definitely have to let me know what i should do with this picture of precious over here in the next part i think i'm going to go ahead and give the girls um makeovers and all of that good stuff paloma is definitely feeling sleepy so i'm going to send her on to bed it is about close to 4 a.m in the morning so we're going to do that i'm also going to send javi to use the bathroom and um, then he can also go to sleep as well. But anyways, I think I'm just going to go ahead and end this part right here. Um, I know we didn't really get a lot done. It was pretty chaotic. I'm not exactly sure what in the world was happening. Um, I definitely need to get a new recording program because I've been having a lot of issues with it as of lately But oh my god, okay. Alrighty. So anyways guys, I thank you all so much for watching I hope you all enjoyed and until my next video. I will see you guys all later